Step up, Jared. One forty-three. One forty-four point eight. Good work. Yeah. One sixty-six point six. Woo. Step up. left you seeing double? If so, you might have found yourself in a fight with Jordan and Jared Porter. Twin MMA fighters from right here in Northern California, the dynamic duel are ready to put their hard-hitting talents on display for the hometown fans. Let's take you inside the cage with the Porter twins. Growing up, man, me and this dude would fight every day. We've got a lot of kids on the block, you know, always getting into mischief, fighting each other. It's cage fighting, this is, just, this is what we do, this, we were born for this. Meet the Porter Twins. Helen from Rodeo, California, Jordan and Jared share the same face and the same goal, a future in mixed martial arts. The uh, UFC gym right there in Concord, so we, uh, we seen that, my dad mentioned that to us. My dad knew growing up we always fighting and getting into mischief, mm -hmm. they said, hey, how about you guys fight, you guys did good in wrestling, how about you try out MMA fighting? And, we walked in there and then we made our way down here to Chris Beam. With a lot of our teammates go a little lighter, you know, you kind of know them, but we're brothers. We, we go at it. We scrap, you know, so it's yeah. probably the best training partner to have a, have a twin brother just with you the whole time. Touting perfect amateur records, the Chris Beam BJJ protégés seek championship glory at the promotional debut of Bay Brawlers. I don't mind standing up and throwing the hands. I like, get, like to get those going, but I like, I'll like i take it to the ground and I'll get, get it done there on the ground too. Me too, you know, I'm a wrestler, but man, I like I felt like throwing crazy hands. I bite down on my mouthpiece, I throw them hard. We bring a lot of fans. We got a lot of people to know us, and we we'll probably bring 200, 300 people, hopefully. We call them, they call themselves the No Let Up Crew. No Let Up Crew. And they're deep. A lot bring, of us We bring come. a lot of people, it's gonna be a lot of fun. The Porters are without question the toughest twins on the NorCal MMA scene today. But here's a good question. What would happen if they ever fought each other? If the price is right, I, 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 I bet yeah. we both do it. I'd I do it. I I'd come, would. come in, swing, have parents to Parents wouldn't know. like it. I know my parents would. Yeah, my parents are talking about that. My mom always saying, don't you guys ever fight each other? I'm like, mom, he's in a lower weight class. But if you ever, if you ever felt like you wanted to get a little bigger, come swing them with me. <laughs> It'd be a great fight to watch. We'd be swinging and we wouldn't. Some tickets. Don't, nobody wants to lose that brother fight. You'd be hearing, hearing about that for the rest of your life. Yeah. <laughs> 
former high school football players, our Chronicle Conversation subjects tonight, the Porter Brothers, who are MMA stars. Welcome, boys. Identical twins. Well, I'm not going to call you boys. You are you are young men, but you are identical twins. So I'm trying to figure it out. Jared, Jared is that yeah. you over there? Yeah. And we have Jordan Porter uh, here. Jordan. All right. Give me your background a little bit. You were high school football players. Uh, football and wrestlers at John Floyd High School. Right out of high school, went hopped straight into MMA fighting. All right. And you are a bantamweight, so you're you're going. Bantam, to, 135. 135. What do you weigh right now? Because you're going to the ring on Saturday. I'm about 145 right now. Ten more pounds to cut. I'll be all right. You'll be all right. And you are going to fight at the Oakland Marietta Convention Center. Elroy Garza is your opponent on Saturday. Have you checked him out yep. at all? Yep. As of now, I guess he likes to go to the ground. I plan on keeping it standing. So. We'll see what happens. Now, you were a high school wrestler, so the, the ground game is something you also can do, but you're going to try to stand up a little well, bit? Well, they say he's a jiu-jitsu guy, yeah. so I mean, I could take him down if I want to, but if he wants to do jiu-jitsu on me, he's going to have to take me down. I like throwing heavy hands, so I'll try to keep it standing. All right, so Jared, uh, uh, who's older, by the way? I'm three, three minutes, minutes older. Three minutes older, just a little and, and you got about, how many pounds do you have on your brother? I, I got about 20 pounds on him. He fights 135, I fight 155, but we don't walk around at that weight. I walk around at actually around 180. And I get down to 155 to fight. Are, are you walking around right now at 180? Not now. I've been <laughs> dropping weight. So right now I'm at about 160, 167. So I still got about. So you got to lose 12 pounds by Saturday? Saturday morning, yeah. You better lay off the kinders. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no kinders for me. And, and you do bring kinders in studio tonight. Yeah. So we are looking forward to it. So uh, do you guys fight each other since you are twin? I mean, I know when you were kids you were fighting. Yeah. And your mom and dad had to pull you apart. But but do you, do, when you get ready for a fight, do you fight each other? In training, well, we, we train with each other. We don't really fight each other. We spar each other all the time. We're really used to how each other fights, but we don't. We're never gonna fight each other. Jared, you've been doing this for like a year and a half. Year and a half in the May, yeah. So well, how did you get into this? Uh, just wrestling. Just right after wrestling, just figured I, watching MMA on TV. Just the UFC gym open. I figured I'd go give it a try. It's been going great so far. All right, so, so you're not part of UFC, you're not part of Strike Force. so what, you, is it, what is it called that you guys do? Camo Amateur. Cam Camo, Camo Amateur MMA. Party. Camo Emmy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and so what, that stands for what? I'm, it's California Mixed, mixed Martial Arts. Mixed Martial Arts, yeah. Well, in May, Mixed Martial Arts. Oh, yeah, Camo, is just, Camo, I'm not sure, it's just Camo. All right, so Jordan, you've got uh, Joshua Berkovich on Saturday. He's only had one professional fight, as did you. You won them both. Uh, how, do you, how do you win on Saturday? Um... I plan on going to the ground. He wrestled, so I'm sure he's going to want to be on the ground, too. So we'll see how that goes. He's, he's been doing Muay Thai. He wants to stand up. I can stand up, too. I can get to swing him. <laughs> I throw heavy hands. Right. So we'll, he'll get hit by a few of them hands and then realize he wants to be on the ground. Hey, you've yeah. only had one previous fight? I fought, I fought twice. Twice? Yeah. And you've won them both, I assume. I've won them both. No one's made it out the second round. All right. So well, mom and dad are here in studio tonight. So yeah. when, when you guys are in the middle of a, of a fight, how do they react? Because you're going back to back on this uh, card, right? Yeah. Yeah, back to back. At first, uh, mom was a little real nervous about it. Actually, my <laughs> first fight, she's in the back, like uh, doing a little bit of crying, like, oh my God. I'm like, oh, you can't be doing this right now. I'm going to have to fight tonight. Right. <laughs> so, right. Yeah, she was uh, a little nervous about growing that. Growing up as high school football players, Raiders or Niners fans? I like the Raiders. Thank you. Yeah, Raiders. Both? Yeah, basically. Niners Raiders. are playing better this year. They got the better record. They do look good. You like this Raider trade they made to get the quarterback, Carson Palmer? Yeah. Is that going to get him over the top? <laughs> yeah. All right, <laughs> we shall see. We'll see what Thank you, gentlemen. I'm not going to call you the boys, the twins, the, the Porter twins, Jared and Jordan, fighting on Saturday at the Oakland Marietta Convention Center, 16th and Broadway. Check them out on Saturday. Both of you win for mom and dad, would you? Yeah, we'll get that win. All right. To the